What's up, y'all? Hey, guys. We're Embrace the Suck 21. Yes, we are. I'm Spencer. And I'm Daniel. And look at what we have before us here. We saw this on EB's channel and Eclectic Beard, for those of you who don't know. This is 13 styles of reactors. This is from Crypt. He's big in, in the YouTube space. He does reactions, he does. reactions, a lot of hip-hop commentary. He does his own music. Yep. I remember uh, No Life Shack always uh, mentioned him in the beginning of his journey. Yes. So uh, he must know what he's talking about. He, uh, he, you definitely should. Yeah. So you, let's dive into this. I'm, yeah. I'm excited. I'm mm. excited. I don't know if we're going to be triggered by this or we're going to start start a heck of a discussion we're, here. I, I think it's definitely discussion worthy. Here. Yeah, you're very discussion worthy. Yo, what is up, everybody? Today we're going to be checking out Eminem's Lose Yourself. Uh, <laughs> I don't know this song, but a lot of people tell me to react to it. So we're going to go ahead and check it out. See what my man's rocking with right here. Yo. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. We all been there. We all done that. Not a lot on this channel, but well, if if there's something that one of us has heard already, then we'll yeah. say that up front. Yeah. And like, like we'll you'll we'll say like, look to me for the reaction. Look to him for the reaction. Yes. Or so. if we both have heard it, it, it turns out being a review. Yeah, a review, and we're we're completely honest about it, hundred yeah. percent of the time. Yeah. Yeah. Let's. Uh, his palms are sweaty, knees weak, arms are heavy. <laughs> yeah. Already, mom's spaghetti. He's nervous. Bro, that song was absolute gas. <laughs> I can't believe I've never heard that song before. Why did you guys let me go my entire reacting career without ever listening to that song? All right, today. Uh huh, uh huh. Shh. Like, I have the problem of, like, if I've heard something before and I. I really like it. I, I mouth off to it. Yep. I, I, you know, you can tell that I'm singing it. You know, like, yeah. like you see that like with the Paul McCartney stuff or Oasis stuff, like I'll start miming along and start go, going like, like that or the queen reaction, you know? Correct. Yeah. But I mean, at that point, we're not claiming it's the first time ever hearing something. Exactly. And that's, it's one of my, my biggest pet peeves. Yeah. You know, it, it, it's, this is why we haven't had champagne supernova or fucking, Wonderwall. Exactly. Or uh, any other Beatles song. I mean, I'm sure yeah. you would react to it, but, you know, yeah. uh, I'm a certified Beatle maniac, yeah. so that's not there it. There you go. Let's. <laughs> what is this one? Number two, The Incorrect Researcher. <laughs> oh, God. Here we go. Let's do it. All right, today we're going to be checking out Lil Nas X. I fucking love Nas, dude. New York <laughs> man of mine. Ill Mac, one of the best <laughs> of all freaking time. <laughs> King's Disease. I'm just saying, if you don't like Lil Nas X, you're not a true fan of rap in the history of rap, okay? He 100% won the beat between Jay-Z. I mean, either. <laughs> it's interesting to see that he's doing the... Uh, the whole homosexual thing now, though. He also looks different, but that's just not <laughs> changes people's appearance, changes their style. My man's adapting with the times because Nas is fucking legit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 it's that, so funny, dude. Uh, right, you can't, get you that can't, off, you can't have Nas. Uh, uh, anyway. It's a completely different one. <laughs> but, but I like, I love the, yeah. That, that bit us in the ass with both Jimmy Savile and Gary Glitter. Oh, yes. Uh, the football chance and then the Jimmy Carr one. That yes. bit us in the ass yes. right there. Oh my Not God. to say it won't ever happen, but hey, it's it's what, what you come here for. Well, Sometimes I mean, a faux pas happens. And, and, and here's, here's my thing. We don't do research before we dive into something. Right. We want it to be true, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, a true, honest to goodness reaction. But at the same time, I'm not trying to spit facts about something I have no idea of. Yeah, it's, it's the whole reason we're checking this thing out yeah. on. It's, oh, my God. If we researched it before, it would ruin it. <laughs> yes, it would. But this right here, <laughs> I, I, I get this is for a dramatic effect. This is for comedic effects. But, you know... It, that was funny as hell. Say, oh, he's doing the gay thing now. I'm like, what? <laughs> that's weird. That's odd. That's odd that Nas did yeah, this. Nas, and he looks different now. And he looks different. That's what rap does to you. Yeah, yeah. As, oh, as much as I'm not a fan of rap, and I don't dislike it, I knew that. Yeah. And I know you know that, too. Uh, yeah, I just say no. No. <laughs> I love that, though. Oh, this is going to be a long episode. We're only yeah. a minute in. Yeah, this. I know. Good God. Style, my man's adapting with the times because Nas is fucking legit. Dude, this has got to be the best hook of the year. Holy shit, this makes me want to fight somebody. Hey, hey, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> the overreactor. I fucking love this song. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, today we're going <laughs> to. Yes, the overreactor. I, I'm guilty of that. I have done that before. 
definitely with the challenging wake and with uh, uh, just something <laughs> so more. Sometimes I will, you know, stand up and and do a silly dance like like that. Or if it's a fat thing, I'll I'll go like this. Yeah, you know, but I don't. It, but that's not every one. Right, right, right. Uh, keep, you are keep, you are better at keeping your I, keep staying in your seats. I I just I have my my stutter down. <laughs> that's when something really truly throws me off. Like I, I just hit like uh, uh, uh I get. That, uh, that white girl surprise repeat thing. <laughs> and it makes my editing job much harder. I bet. I bet. <laughs> I'm not saying never do it again. Oh, I'm just no. saying I'm just letting you know. Yes, I will keep doing it. Keep doing Correct. it. Keep being you. Correct. But <sighs> overreaction. All right. Yeah. Yo, today we're going to be looking at <laughs> Eminem's 8 Mile. Let's get it. That was fire. Subscribe. All right, today we got. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you won't see a lot of that out of us. No. I mean, certainly in the beginning when we were trying to, you know, find our voice, trying to figure out uh, stuff. But I don't know. I don't. I don't get how you could be low energy and have a no ha- have a reacting uh, career. Because it's not really reaction. It's no. like a. I don't know what it would be called. It's just an underwhelming experience. Yeah, yeah. And it's kind of a waste of time. Yeah, but you don't want to watch someone under, underreact. Right, but the same, but at the same time, there, there, there occasionally are certain things that we check out that I, I don't have a, you know, big reaction to, and you certainly don't either. Yeah, you, no, you know, not every one of them. Yeah, but yeah. But at the same time, definitely not monotone Ben Stein on it. Yeah, for yeah, yeah, for yeah. checking out Eight Mile Dry that, Eyes. Yes, that was great. Bueller, Bueller, yeah, Bueller. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, today we got Eminem, and I know a lot of you guys like Eminem, but this dude is fucking trash. Okay, trash cheeks, white ass, trailer park fucking rapping ass whore. All right, this guy is no good. <laughs> That's all this motherfucker does. Never has been good, never will be good, but we'll react to him. This, this sucks. This fucking sucks. How do people listen to this, bro? Like, how do people listen to this music? What kind of metaphorical <laughs> dumbass shit is that? You only get one shot? Don't miss your chance to blow? Trash. I'm just going to be real with you guys. I think Eminem might be top five worst rappers alive. Okay, and when he dies, probably be one of the worst rappers to ever live. All right. <laughs> <sighs> okay, uh, I totally disagree with that about Eminem. I know it was for comedic yes. effect, but fuck it. I, <sighs> but, you know, I'll be real. You know, sometimes we'll check out something and it ain't good. What? That would never happen here. Like on a Radiohead or Blur. Never. Exactly. Never. Exactly. But at the same time, it's just not for us. This is not the we like everything show. Yeah, this is a reaction channel. <laughs> yeah. It's not a watch it and say it's good channel. It's not a yeah. watch it and agree with your viewpoint channel. Uh, just it, reaction it, channel. And I think they do that with beloved people like Emin. Like it, I don't think it's happened with Eminem. Maybe, maybe not. But oh, it's happened. It has to. But that's for. The wow effect. Yeah, yeah, to to get people talking. Yeah, you want you want negative comments in your comment section. You do something like that. Hey, and it, they'll just bleh. And it drives engagement. It does. Gets views. It does. It does. It's just a reality <laughs> of uh, the situation. Yeah. What is this number six? The Dick Rider. The Dick Rider. All right. Here we go. Ever live. All right, today we're going to be reacting to Eminem. Just dropped a brand new song called Godzilla. Eminem, unarguably and undoubtedly the greatest rapper to ever live, currently alive of all time. Not a single bad song in my man's discography, okay? Fact, fucking love that song. You guys just don't appreciate the lyrical greatness that Eminem has on it. So many metaphors, so many double entendres, so many different flow switches, you guys don't even fucking comprehend the shit, okay? Don't come at me in the comments saying Eminem has shitty songs like Fact. Fact is fucking great, okay? (laughs) Fact you, if you don't like Fact, okay? Fact. Bro, Jack... (laughs) That's... That's honestly one of the main reasons that we stopped uh, doing regular Oasis reactions or Arctic Monkeys reactions because we know they're great and we don't want to, and we probably won't revisit them until they have new music out. Correct. Yeah, that's why 
I mean, I hate to say it, and I know a lot of our older fans are not going to like it, but, you know, I, I just don't know where else we can go with Oasis after doing the Supersonic there, documentary. There's nothing that can be said that we haven't already said. Correct. About yeah. it. So it's kind of like, you want to hear repeat, just watch another one of their, one of our reactions to one of their older songs. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you know? yeah. yeah. I mean, they'll, they'll always be great and, you know... Certainly, there's other you know, shows that we frequent on this channel, like, you know, What I Lie to You, Graham Norton Show, Ricky Gervais Show, um, anything Carl Pilkington related. Well, you it know. changes up, though. It's yeah. not the, like a. Yeah. It's it, not the it, same thing. Yeah. It changes, like, panels change, topics change, so it's fresh. Yeah. 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 Exactly. <laughs> they get yeah. it. They yeah, get I think, it. I think so. I hope so. I hope so. Oh. <laughs> if you don't, you got to leave a comment. Correct. <laughs> Bro, Jack Harlow just has this nasty little flow So nice and concise and compact Almost as compact as my Ridge wallet That I got from the Ridge wallet uh, in the description For up to 40% off right now Seriously, they're, they're sponsoring the video The wallets are awesome uh, dude, dude just got like just the sharpest of minds His punchline's off the dome His flow is in, his rap is so sharp Almost as sharp as this new knife That I got from the Ridge wallet Go download to the description and get these for up to 40% off right now Seriously, they sponsored this video. I make vets feel like they junior. So ah, nah, nah, nah. See, see, dog, that's cap. I like the rest of this, but that's cap. Like, you just, you're not making vets feel like they're juniors, okay? Jack, you're good in the game, but you're still, you're still like a freshman in the game. So that's cap. You know what else is cap? This hat from the Ridge Wallet. Yeah. <laughs> this video. Go down to the description. Get some stuff for up to forty percent off. Hello, everybody. <laughs> yes. We we have yet to do any uh, sponsor deals yet, and I mean. I'm not saying it'll never ever happen, but come on, man! Yeah. Right, right there, that's uh, it's, it's off putting. It's off putting. It's very off putting. It's you know, there's there's a tactful way to do things, right? Right. But that puts me off a video. Many a, a reaction channel or or a reaction that does this throws me off. I won't watch it from yeah. that point on, or I will look to skip that part. Yeah, yeah, and 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 if we were going to do a sponsored deal, like it would have to be something that would make sense to Correct. our audience. You yes. know, I mean, I've seen No Life Shack have sponsors from Hello Fresh at the beginning of the video, and that's I don't think that's anything wrong with that. No, nope. but you we're know? not going to do edible arrangements. No, not edible arrangements. You know, um, <laughs> not uh, what's manscaped. Yeah, that would be funny. Actually, that would be funny. That would be funny. <laughs> I think we'd have fun with that one. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. But that would be great. But anyway, things like this that throw off the rhythm of a video, I hate them. Yeah, come on. Them. Come on. Three <laughs> percent off. Hello, everybody. I am Dr. Rap, and today we're going to be checking out Eminem's Lose Yourself. Um, now, if you don't know, I am a rapper myself. A rapper is typically somebody that formulates words together in a rhyming pattern of sorts to generally <sighs> describe a certain situation that they are in or their environment and today we're going to listen to Eminem do just that. Fun fact, if you did not know, rap was created in the late 1970s <laughs> in the Bronx. So if you don't understand that, you should probably go educate yourself before you watch this video. His palms are sweaty and he's weak. His palms would only be sweaty if he was nervous. <laughs> as well as his knees being weak. That or he could have restless leg syndrome, which I've had at one point in my life. Very not worth it, okay? Let me tell you, it's very hard to sleep with restless leg syndrome. <laughs> the only reason Eminem would have sweaty palms is this, he was nervous. But I hope he goes on to describe how nervous he is in this situation. Palms are heavy, there's vomit on his sweater already. Mom's spaghetti, he's nervous. Again, him talking about this nervousness. I'm glad that he brought up the nervousness because I predicted the nervousness. The rhyme schemes were leading oh, me to shit. the word nervous, and he did not disappoint. I, I read him like the book that he is rapping right now. But um, the only reason he would be nervous and vomiting on his own sweater, his mother's spaghetti, meaning one, he's still in his mother's home at the age that he is at, so he's not in a good situation financially. You can already understand. <laughs> Would he be eating his mother's spaghetti and being nervous while eating his mother's spaghetti? It's definitely because he has a rap show coming up and he's not a successful rapper yet because he's still living in his mother's I'm house, eating his mother's spaghetti, vomiting his mother's on. spaghetti on his sweater already. <laughs> oh. 
that's about a minute of our life that we're never going to get back. It's, uh, but I can't with some people that do this. Yeah. Like, I, I want to see you react to a song that is beloved by me. Uh-huh. Not break down every, like the, the ethos and the, the backstory behind the lines. Some people do that, and it's very irritating. <laughs> yeah. Like, I mean, granted, if, if it's something that either one of us know a lot, you know, we could speak on it from experience, like you with construction work and military and me with music and with other, um, with motorsports. Yep. You know, we could talk at length about, you know, comparisons to what's happened to be versus what our own experience with it. Yep. And, you know, and like, I, we try and keep it short. We try and, you know, not over explain it, but. But we do go off on tangents. We do go off on tangents. We're going off on one right now. Yeah. What? Are we? Is that what this is? We're over explaining the over explaining. We're over explaining the over explaining. <laughs> I guess we're number eight on this one. Well, I guess we, we maybe we are. What? And just throw the thing. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. How dare you? <laughs> <sighs> Mother spaghetti on his sweater already. No, no, no. I want it to be a little more natural. <laughs> There's naked gay guys in the video. Come on. <laughs> that works. I like it. What's. <laughs> y'all yeah, could probably tell by now we don't really do a lot of thumbnails. Um, and it, cause you, most of the time YouTube will generate a thumbnail that, uh, will work. And you know, it, it's, it's one of us, you know, making a face like that. Uh, I'll, I'll do it occasionally for something that where YouTube doesn't generate a good thumbnail yep. or if it's something, you know, special, something that we like our year end, the year Com end compilations. compilations. Yeah. Or, or like a vlog or something, yep. something that, you know, and, and like for my, my, my music, uh, on my music channel, uh, what am I doing? Cover or with my Eurovision deep dive, I'll make one for that. But like, I just don't, we've gone this far without having consistent thumbnails and I think we'll be all right. I mean, yeah. if we get, if, if we get to a point where we can hire someone to do it, we might, but at the same time, I think we're doing okay with that. But, it. but at least our thumbnail comes from within the video. Yeah. I, 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 it, there's a, there's a part of me that wants to punch people in the throat when it's a face that, yeah, that, that does nothing to do with it. It has nothing to do with it. Yeah. And, and I, I hate that shit. Yeah. Which by the way, before, uh, before we get, before we start, let's, uh, let's, let's make some thumbnail faces. Ready? Feel free to screenshot any of those <laughs> and make some memes out of it. And and share with us on our Instagram at yeah. Embrace the Suck 21. Link in the description. Yeah. All right. See how I transitioned I, there? I did that. I, but a smooth transition is priceless. Exactly. I like it. What's crack a lacking, my flacking jackins? Uh, it is your boy MC Slacken right here, and I'm a rapper myself. You guys can follow me on my Spotify. I'm at two monthly listeners right now, but I'm getting my shit going. I uh, got bars for days. You can check it out right now. Nope. I'm the best fucking rapper in the game right now. Bitches <laughs> walking to me like I'm a cow. So since I got bars for days, I can understand bars for days. And who else to understand bars for days than to listen to Eminem? Yo, what's going? on it <laughs> uh, i feel seen because i am a, a musician myself and i don't uh i'm not a rapper i'm not i'm not, I, I have beachy america americana and at the beginning and end of every single video you do hear one of my songs yes. in there yes but you know i try not to you know push it every single time because i know you don't come here for that no those who ha who have when i do talk about it they have come over to the music channel, and you know that's that's, that's appreciated. Cool. It's much appreciated. Yes. So, <laughs> correct. <laughs> that I'm just trying to I, that 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 song that he put out with the I'm the best. They ever. flock to me like I'm a cow. That's a good boy. <laughs> what, what whatever that beat was was trash. I loved it. I, I mean, I loved. I, I loved I, it. It's it's definitely. Uh, it's a hit. Make it number one. Make it number one. <laughs> uh, all right, let's uh, back this up a bit. 
Yo, what's going on everybody? It is your boy Crypt here. Welcome back to another video. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Crypt. I am a rapper myself. You can check out my Spotify right here with millions of streams and songs with Billboard charting fucking artists, dipshits. Better hit the deck. Yes, we will check him out. We will check them out. Yep. If you want to see that, comment below what you want uh, to see from him. Hashtag who is Crypt. Yeah, hashtag in the, who is Crypt. In the, in the, in the comments. Exactly, exactly. Mmm, mm, did you hear that? Better hit the deck like the card dealer. So what he means by that is, you know, whenever you're, whenever you uh, hit the deck, you know, like cards. <laughs> He's looking it the up. Deck, uh, when you hit the deck, you hit the deck. Um, and what Eminem is saying right here is he's advising caution to those around him. Uh, Eminem suggests that others hit the deck, as in the naval term, from the Navy, to fall to the ground for protection. But it's also the double entendre that hit the deck is also a popular card game and a common phrase in blackjack. Yeah. Dope punchline. Dope punchline. Took me a minute to figure it out, but I got that one all by myself. <laughs> all right, let's get back to it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll admit, we've done that. I mean, not, you know, showing it on the screen, but I'll often, oftentimes I'll have the phone right here with the lyrics up, and we'll, we'll, we'll look it out for it and, you know, not go so far as to do that. But, no. Well, know. like, you, we've had our phones up to read lyrics but that's yeah. because sometimes it's very difficult to understand stuff. Yeah. And if we didn't have the lyrics, half the shit would go over our heads. Exactly. Yeah. It's like with the song Arctic Monkeys, When the Sun Goes Down. We didn't know that was about a prostitute. No. At, from, just from listening to it. No. So. <laughs> but you're not breaking down each line and no. giving the history about it. And right. And be like, oh, I just, I, I got that. Like, yeah. No, you didn't, dude. Right, no, you right. Didn't. And plus, it's part of the reaction is, you know, hearing it and listening, lo looking at what the word is and come having your own interpretation of it. Yes. And not have it to, you know, explain, have it explained oh. to you via the Internet. Yep. All right. We got one more here. All right. Let's get back to it. One shot. Mm, you guys hear that? You only get one shot. Play that back. One shot. You're not hearing me. One shot. How many shots do you get? One shot. Yo, Em, how many <laughs> shots do you get? One shot. Man, I had to go get my second dose of my vaccination the other day, and I rolled up, and the guy said, hey, you got the Johnson & Johnson? I said, yeah, I had the Johnson & Johnson. He said, how many shots you getting? I said, one shot. Very nice. Very nice. That is worthy of a subscription yep. right there. Well, this was, uh, this was a heck of a uh, This was great. A talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was a talk. Yes, a heck of a discussion, a heck of a two-thumbs-up-worthy yeah. yeah. uh, reaction. I yeah, I like this. I like this. This is definitely a um, different level. Yeah. I, I like this. I like that a lot. Anything honestly. that can that can um, unveil yeah. some pull, people. Pull back the curtain a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I'm a fan of. Yeah. Oh, man. Uh, Just let us know what style we are. What's Yeah, what style are we? I think it's like a combination of like 10 of these. Yeah, I think so, too. It depends on what you're watching and what. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think so too. I think we have to pull be we have to be a little bit of each one. Yeah. So it it just depends on the day, it depends on your mood. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Oh my god, it does. Yeah. And the content. Exactly. So. Exactly. So I'm thinking this is gonna be a podcast episode. I yeah, this is a good one. Yeah. This is a good one for a podcast. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> podcast. Yeah, that we occasionally revive. Once in a while. Once, Once in, in a while. while. Yes. Right. <laughs> Anyway, y'all, Vic, mm, I'm, I'm going to be the uh, underreactor here. Yes. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing, hitting the bell, share it with your friends. <laughs> what? And unplug and do something epic! <laughs> See you next time! Later! <laughs> Fellas, we can be that mistake. Let's do this.